Yes, the beard has gone. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, Look at how bad it is. Happy birthday to Josh. We're at the beach, mother. Morning guys, welcome along to episode three of Mickey Vlogs. You may be wondering, what the hell is on your face? Well, I think that every single day I look in the mirror. I mean, when you shave your beard off, it's gonna look a bit scary. So I thought I would just prepare you guys and get you ready when I take this off. Yes, the beard has gone. I had an accident when I was shaving and <laughs> you're gonna see it. Do you wanna see it? Do you wanna see me with no beard? Are you ready? Hit like on the video now and I'll do it. You done it? <sighs> Deep breath, calm down. Of course I wouldn't shave my beard off. What do you think I am? Silly Billy? <laughs> anyway guys, hello. It's Tuesday, because I worked all day yesterday. Jess is over there. The jungle is still here, because it is continuously raining every day. Yeah, you're Jess, hello. Oh yes, so I got a phone call, and Niall wants to go meet me for coffee in Costa. So, I'm basically got to leave in one minute. <laughs> Sorry, I've been working so hard lately, I'm tired every day. <laughs> Who knows what this episode will bring these two weeks. I know this weekend we have Latvian Midsummer, which involves barbecue, food, uh, drinking, fire. You have to like jump over fire and stuff. Stuff like that. We also have Josh, that's actually on the 22nd, which is also my son Josh's 14th birthday. So I shall be collecting him after work in the afternoon and having him for a couple of hours with Leo as well. So, yeah. But the thing I need to do, I need to change these balloons and the banner to a blue one because Josh isn't a girl. <laughs> anyway, guys. I better go for Noel cries. <laughs> See you in a bit. Oh, it didn't turn off. Cheeky Costa time coming along. Three hours later. So, at this point, I just want to address something. You may have seen a tweet I put out the other day on Twitter about an issue I was disappointed with people and in uh, people's attitudes. Well, obviously, you guys know that I did the Brave the Shave auction on eBay and in the last vlog you saw me boxing it up for the lady that I sent it to. Well, it turns out she bought this and she won this auction for her mother who wanted a full spectrum camera. Now, just to let you know what was it, there was a signed poster, personalised, from UK Haunted, so myself and Alex. There was a set of stickers for my Ghostal logo. logo. Uh, you have the beanie hat, brand new, and also I thought I'd throw in the full spectrum camera. You know, it's old, it's, uh, it's been converted obviously, because you can't get full spectrum cameras that are ready made like that in the factory. They have to be converted, so obviously they're second hand. Well, she won it for £40, which is good price to add to my uh, Brave the Shave cause and the running total. And she got received the items and she sent me a message and she was saying that oh where's the leads where's the box my mum my mum needs this and it's like really i did say it was brand new the listing actually said new under like the items but obviously the, the hat's new the poster's new and all that i threw in the full spectrum camera as like a bonus now why the hell would she try and win this auction just for some old Fuji film full spectrum camera. It's just a little digital camera one. Why, why would you do it? It don't even look new. 
it looks old and battered. But I thought I would pull it in as a bonus, like I said. And I said, oh, if you're not happy, you know, just send it back and I'll give you a refund. So she said, okay, really? So I now, I've put that 40 pound in my Brave the Shave fund. So I now have to find 40 pound off my own money. I know technically it's hers, but I've donated that. To refund her. So I've then got to get the items back from her and then relist it all again, just to try and get money again for the, for the cause. It's like, what a twat. Sorry, but this is for charity. Why the hell would you look for a full spectrum camera as a present for your mother on a, an auction for other things? Just go for full spectrum cameras. It's simple. Because the head, the title of the listing did not even say full spectrum camera. It just said, Mickey, you're brave to shave. That's it. So I, I don't want to say, I don't want to abuse her because obviously that's not nice, but what the fuck are you doing? But anyway, I, I requested that she send back the personalized poster on principle. So if anyone out there is called Jenny and would like a poster for free, a UK Haunted sign poster, let me know in the comments or on Twitter at the real Mickey York. Let me know and once I receive it all, I will send that to you for free. But, oh, it's just a hassle, it's just a ball ache. Why the fuck people have to be like that? I'm just so disappointed. She knew it was a charity thing. It was a charity fundraiser. How the fuck can you re return charity winning like auction items? It's just fucking deluded, I tell you. I don't know what to say, but I don't care if she's watching this. You have disappointed me. I'm raising money for fucking cancer patients and you had a very strong connection to cancer. Not that you've got it, but wow. And you are, you are taking money out of a cancer fund just so that you can have peace of mind for your mother. Oh, she didn't really like that camera. Oh my God. So yeah, shame on you. I don't give a fuck if people abuse me for this section of this video. Shame on you. I'm not gonna stay quiet because it's pissed me off. It's caused me hassle, not impressed at all. <sighs> anyway. I had a good morning. I met Niall. We had two flat whites each. Hour and a half. In Costa. Yay. Not a cheeky Costa, we had two proper Costas. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Let's start this week. Well, hi guys. It is Thursday afternoon. We've actually had a dry day so far. So I might actually tackle this back garden look at how bad it is oh it's starting to rain now really i am sick to death of this fucking weather i'm sick to death of june it's just it's just so wet sick of it wet june that's what it's called wet june yeah, come home. I was gonna do the garden. It's like half three, finish work. And it's raining. Pisses me off. Really, really pisses me off. Quite impressed with some of this grass though. Because I put the grass here. Well, the grass seeds, anyway. No, Jess sits on this. I mean, look. Absolutely ridiculous, this garden. We need a skip to get rid of all that crap. All the old furniture. The stuff in the shed. It's a nightmare. Oh. <laughs> Tomorrow. So I've had a go. This is all done with the hand shears, not even the electric hedge trimmer. Oh no, my back is absolutely killing me. I'm just going to hit it with the lawnmower. 
fuck it. <sighs> I'm dripping. We need a skip. Anyone got a free skip? <laughs> got cobbles on me. Covered in grass. Covered in lots of bugs. And... There's some glass down there, look. You see that? It's not good, is it? Poor Jesse. Oh, wow. More glass here. There must have been a glass out here from last year's parties or whatever. Yeah, someone tried to get in that gate the other day as well. Got out here in the evening and the gate was wide open. So give it a couple of days. And uh, cut it again. Oh, if we can just get a skip and empty all this crap, all the old furniture, this would be bare. All that shit down there. And that's before you even look down this section. That's just disgusting. Later. Hello you lovely people. It is Friday afternoon. And yes, the pink balloons have gone. They have been replaced by the blue ones. Because it's Josh's birthday tomorrow. Yep. Happy birthday, Josh. Oh, so after work tomorrow, I should be collecting him from his mum's house. And he'll be coming here with Leo for a couple of hours. And we're gonna open presents and cards, stuff like that. And then he'll go back to his mum's. Yeah. Grass is still short, it hasn't grown that quick. <laughs> Oh, all right, people, cooking dinner. See you in a bit. <laughs> so it's 3 p.m. Saturday afternoon, and I'm driving home from work, and I'm getting Josh. Yes, picking him up, with Leo as well, obviously. And uh, hopefully he's had a good birthday so far. And I'll be taking him back to my house for a couple of hours, open his presents, see the balloons, see the banners, and hopefully he has a nice little, little time, you know. So, uh, yeah. I've replaced all the rovers and I'm seeing some With blue ones, with boy ones. It's an improvement. <laughs> wow, well, thank you. Better. Happy birthday to Josh. <laughs> la la la. <laughs> Big brother. Yeah, we'll see, read it. Who else will I read it? No. Read the, the card itself. It's about Big Brother. Yeah. Am I blind? Yes. Here. Yeah, what's that say? Your Rosser. Your Rosser, it's a dinosaur card. <laughs> what's it saying? Maybe it's Dynamite. <laughs> dynamite. I think you, you picked this one out. <laughs> <laughs> or Ava picked it out. Okay, happy birthday, son. Growing up, you were always were a cheeky little chappy. Oops, I'm in trouble now. A boy who had the special gift of making others happy. This is my cheer up dance. Kindness and respect are things you, you've learned along the way. Do you want to share my cake? So your thoughtful, your thoughtfulness has made you who you are today. I'm a bit good me. So very proud and happy to have you for a son. Don't worry, I'll help you. To you, Josh, happy 14th birthday. Hope your day turns out to be very special. To be a very special one. Happy birthday. Hope you have a great day. Love, Daddy and Mummy Siggy. Best loving ever. box. I'm trying to figure out where it is before I open it. Go on. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, this fell out. Wait. This fell out. I'm not sure if it's anything to do with that. It's a handle. Okay. It's the GoPro I asked for. Is it the same one you've got? No. Actually, you got it. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you, Mr. G. If she's watching this. <laughs> Okay, I'll have to show you. Yeah. I don't mind, I started recording, no mind. Okay. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I think it was I got really confused. What's it doing? I was like, what is this? Oh, it's all the attachments for it. Yeah. Thank you, Daddy. Oh, mate. Thank you, Miss Siggy, if you're watching it. Not sure if you are, but... Josh is having fun, trying to figure out how to put all the attachments together. He's now walking around the garden with a GoPro on his head. Yeah. Just be lucky you can walk around the grass. Because <laughs> the other day you couldn't walk on the grass. Yeah. Three hours later. So tonight we have Latvian midsummer party, like we do every year with Siggy's family. Got some booze. Gonna be some fire barbecue. Should be good. Oh no, look at that face. <laughs> Get off your phone. Get off your phone. Stop, stop, Bernie. That worked then with the bark? Yeah, that oh, yeah. really good for that. Yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, if I ever set fire That's something. how we used to do when we needed oh, to go to house and stuff. We fill them up <laughs> and they sleep with bed. They go really easy. Look, they take it really quick. Yeah, because it's so dry. It's no, the bark thingy, it works really good. Oh, I have the The sound it makes like Get me from there. Ow, ow. No. Thank you. 
เรียจริงจริงลัทเวียมิดซัมเมอร์อิสดอมอาซิลัสมาชัยดอนเบิร์ดอัคเปิลดิ้งส์นัตตานัตซินส์นิวเยียร์ลูกค้าไอเวอร์ไอบราว์ส์วิทมีเราจะไปที่ซิกิสมอมแอนด์ดัตส์ฮาวส์เพื่อรับเขาออกไปและช่วยเขาในบ้านเพราะเราเป็นคนดีคนเราพบกันครั้งหน้าในวลอกวันอีเทอร์นิตี้ลัทเอล Yeah, so uh, did an extra shift today. Finished at ten o'clock. Just come back home, but I've got no petrol left, so I needed to stop at Tesco, as I just have, and filled up. I'm so tired, but I've got two days off now. <laughs> The joys of staff not working and me doing extra. Oh, people, people, people! It's Monday morning. I'm not at work because I worked so hard yesterday. Changed my shift, so I don't need to work now till Wednesday. Jesse, Jesse, Jesse. Yeah, yeah. So uh, got up, swept my washing out. You don't care about my washing, do you? No. Right, I'm off to the post office. Two parcels to collect. Come, Jess. Come. Yeah, two parcels to collect, and I got to pay money to my bank, and then get I might get a cheeky Costa, and then come home and uh, start editing this vlog. And next weekend we might be going to the seaside. I think Saturday, so I need to make sure it's up to date. Otherwise, I'm not gonna have time to. To post it and get it finished, and but yeah, boys are coming today. A few inches later, here we go. Although one of these, you know, I said about the lady posting the braid to shave winning stuff back to me. Well, she's put Mickey as the address. Now I don't have any idea that says my name is Mickey, so they might have to re-deliver that. That's a pain in the ass, but we'll see when we get there. Well, they let me have it. She didn't even ask who Mickey is. Just wrote Mickey in big letters. Not even my name, my surname, nothing. It's like, don't you know my name? Wow, this lady. Words don't. 
they don't come out very well. <laughs> so when I get home, I'm gonna open it and make sure everything is in there before I give her her money back. Also, the poster as well. The poster has to be in there because she's not having a free poster. She's gonna fuck me about and fuck my cancer charity auction about. Let's go. Hello. Got to be done. Last year, latte was the drink for me. This year, flat white. Can't be beaten. Cannot be beaten. Anyway, guys. This is the parcel. Nice scent as part of the Brave the Shave. Let's see if everything's there. So disappointed that this has come back. Can't believe this has come back, man. Stupid. Why would you buy this for the camera? It's just an old crappy camera anyway. The camera was just like a bonus. What an idiot. Oh, we've got the hat, we've got the stickers still here. What the fuck is in that? Where's the camera? So yeah, there you go. It's not a shitty camera. It's fairly clean. I got that years ago and I converted it to full spectrum myself. Right. I presume the posters in there then, yeah. I also picked up another parcel as well. You'll like this. I've worked so many hours. And why not? Why not buy things that I like, that I want, that I use? No. Nothing wrong with that. Otherwise, it's just going to work yourself into the ground and your life is going to be shit. Go. Ooh, we got a box, man. We got a box. It's in a box, actually. It's in a box. In a box. I did nothing. Would you reckon it could be? Pause the video now. Pause the video and comment below what's in the box. Hashtag it. What's in the box? I'm waiting. Come on. Yes, we have another nun doll. You guys probably didn't see the valet doll, did you? Because I wasn't doing the vlog then, wait there. Wait there. So obviously since the last vlogs, you haven't seen the dolls I've had over the, the winter months. We had the Ouija doll, which you may have seen with the video of the portal. What I put in last week, I think. And you haven't seen valet. So I have sort of like a thumbnail that I can click that from. So I, yeah, so this is Valak. Handmade. Amazing quality. Absolutely amazing. Some of the other Valak dolls look so shit and cheap, but yeah. So yes, we have another one to add to my desk area. Should we go over to my desk? Come on, should we go, should we go? Let's go away, we can have a little chat on the way. So yeah, I've got some more bits that I've put up. Got the Alley Law poster. The personal message, which you saw in week, or well, not week, is it week anymore, is it? It's episode now. Episode one. And this is from Hellfire Caves that I got when I took Josh. Hello, Robert. Yeah, I need a bigger wall now. <laughs> so. No, I need somewhere for this one to go. You can go there for now. Put you in the cup. Okay. <laughs> oh shit. Maybe that won't work. That was a good idea. 
stay in the cut. Maybe that'll work, I don't know. So yeah, I'm gonna get on with editing this vlog that you're watching now. And I will see you in a bit, guys. I'm gonna my coffee. I've got love on Monday. See you later. Later. Well, hi guys. It's Tuesday lunchtime. I have just popped out to work to do a little session with uh, one of the guys at work. Come back and I've been recording. We're making a video. What is in my paranormal kit bag? Yes, that video may or may not be out this week. Well, that's bright, isn't it, that light? Um, so yeah. Anyway, the weather today is shockingly bad. Yesterday it was so hot and sweaty. Spent the afternoon in the garden, doing some editing. But today, it's not happening at all. It is just so wet. It's been raining since about, whoa, sorry. It's been raining since about four o'clock this morning. And I want to show you, look. Yesterday it was so hot. And I had all my washing out on the line. And today, it's dog poo. You can't win with this weather, I tell you. On Saturday, we are planning to go to Hun Stanton, to the beach with me, Siggy, and the kids. I'm just hoping that goes ahead because it's probably gonna be raining. I don't wanna go to the beach. I'm gonna go anyway, I don't care. I go in the, in the sea when it's raining. It makes it more fun. Anyway, guys, gonna have my lunch. See you in a bit. Later. Right, so I finished editing the video of the return to the Polish house with Ben. That will be up on YouTube already, so if you haven't seen it, the link is there. Go check it out. It's another good one. Just preparing food for the next couple of days. So we've got pasta bake there for tomorrow. And we're about to make toad in the hole here, aren't we? Yeah. I mean, I'm going to make the Yorkshire puddings. Yeah, you're making the mix to put in it. Hopefully. But yeah, what a weird day. Sweaty again. It's raining. I'm not impressed. Well done, time to put it in. There's a pouring hole there. All over. Make sure it's all covered. All in. Oh, that might be, that's gonna be massive, maybe. <laughs> Oops. Oh well. Oh. No, Josh. Yeah. Uh, you never put too much Yorkshire. No, I mean, I don't know how what it's going to be like. Maybe it's going to be. I'm going to cook. No? It's just how much there is. Yeah. But it might, it might go really, 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 really big, so I might just put that shelf up. So I've decided to go back on the old Tassimo machine. So I've got loads of Costa lattes sitting in the drawer. Plus I'm not on my diet anymore, so it might as well. Not yet. Lovely Costa Latte, just for me. <laughs> Bet you're jealous, aren't you? Josh is jealous. Yeah. There we just see him. You can't. Can I do this on the screen? There he is. There's little Josh, wave. Yeah. Back to me. Oh, that's like cinema stuff. A few inches later. Hey, look at that. <laughs> Careful. Oh my god! Hey, look at that! That's a big mama. There is some sausages under there somewhere. 
What, I better start the gravy now? Doing the gravy. Get the gravy out then. Should be up here on the left. In there. What's in, what's in there? That's a restaurant. It's a restaurant. It, yeah, it'd be up here on the left, it says. Round this corner on the left, it says. And, oh, that way. I don't think it's as hot as it is out here. No, it won't, Josh. <laughs> oh, okay, it's in there. Oh. Oh, so cool. Oh, you get hot and everything. Yeah. A few inches later. <laughs> Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Alright, it's not a friendly place for me. <laughs> no, I think now you are so long. Yeah, you are so so. The Europeans are fine, but in my country, yes.
place is crazy. Hey Josh. Sorry mate. There we go. Let me go. Josh, do you want a picture with the mask on? That's like an original from the war. Amazing. You got the baby mask. Look at that. That's pretty heavy, though. It's heavier than that one. Right, so yeah, the tour is finished, and we just come back to take some pictures. <laughs> what did you think, Josh? Did you like the tour? Yeah. Yeah? It's not what I thought it would be. To be honest, I don't know. From what I was seeing in the gift shop, it was like these big yellow caverns and a bit like Hellfire, like the river sticks. That's what I thought it would be like. But it is good, yeah. It's good to learn about history, you know. Yeah, exactly. It just, it, we just went around in a circle, didn't we? <laughs> yeah. So there we go. That's pretty cool. Shame uh, Siggy, Ava, Leo couldn't join us. Only two spaces available on the tour. And they volunteered us, so thank you to them. I don't think Leo's too happy, but I don't know where they are. They might be in the museum now, so he'll go find them. 20 minutes later. And the lights are out and you're stumbling in the dark. You kept pushing on, but then you went too far. When your ship has sailed and all your dreams are lost, everything is wrong. So it's Sunday morning. We are current we're currently at McDonald's. Ava's moaning about ice because she's an ice fanatic fam. And we've been got some breakfast, but they didn't get my wrap. So Siggy has gone to find my wrap somewhere. Yes, Ava's been practicing Rap God by Eminem. Video coming soon. Yeah. Come on! It's my food! <laughs> I don't know how I feel. Man. I don't know what I feel, I'm just filming out the car at the shop. Dog is barking. Three hours later. No. Oh, look, look, they got wind farms in the sea. So we've made it to Hunstanton. It's there. Daddy. Leo -y. Oh my god, are they flies? Yeah, it's because it's yellow. Oh my god. Oh wow. We should paint it. Paint it. Yeah. That's fine. Oh, okay. Oh, that's quite warm, isn't it? Yeah. Where'd she go? Over there. Oh, I took my bag. I don't think it's I lost my seat. Why is it so pale? Look at that. Really not okay. Look at that thing. Yeah, you got black trousers on. Ah, with these shells. I don't know what's painted on. Why do you paint sand at me? Oh, there's the water. Oh, Over there. Oh. I can't walk through all that again. Where are we going down that down there? Ah. Hey, Look, do you know how painful that was? Oh, hey, hey, you've got you two choices. Big sandcastle here. Or bits now. I'll use wet sand. Wet sand's better than this. Yeah. He put all this gravel on the beach, man. <laughs> 
Oh, that's a bit better. Oh, then we get nice sand. Yeah, get used to it. I just said she was gonna go swimming. She's doing it, wasn't it? It wasn't as cold. It's alright, you get used to it in a minute. Once you stand there for a little bit, this reminds me of when we were in Blackpool and we went out, didn't we? And we stayed in the sea and I really like Blackpool Beach, that main promenade bit. I've got to walk on this side, what to say there? Yeah? Ava's starting. Fucking, <laughs> <laughs> okay, my bomb's coming out! <laughs> <laughs> Looks like I was going to be there. How far is she going? It's really warm, isn't it? It's warmer here, yeah. I thought it'd be a bit lot colder. Seems a little shallow bit for quite cold. Hey, that is fucking waste time. I thought she was joking. Of course she wasn't. No? Of course. <laughs> oh, they're in. They're in. It's only a creature, a jellyfish or something. Just is up there somewhere. Oh, they're, they're in it. I really, I really thought she was joking about that. I don't know. It's good. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, then I trip up and go backwards, and I think, oh, she. <laughs> Why does the sea look brown? Is it just my glasses? Dirty sea. Cornwall, it's nice and clear. Blackpool's clear, isn't it? This is East Anglia Sea. That's where they do the oil, isn't it? Ha <laughs> <laughs> you went yourself. <laughs> Ava and Leo are out in the sea. They're actually swimming. Swimming back to shore. Well proud of them for doing that. Crazy, I wouldn't have done that at their age. Something just touched my foot. That's disgusting. It like wrapped around my leg. Yeah. Ava! Shark! Shark! Shark. <laughs> that didn't work, did it? Yeah. Ah, something's touched my leg again. Oh. I got Leo. You know, mate, you're drowning. No. I'm fine. Is it a bit wet? Yeah. Yes, yeah, it's, it's a sea, it's gonna be wet. It's lovely. I can't even swim in this. Come and dry off then. <laughs> what are you doing, Leo? I'm not. 
Are you being a seal? So I think Stiggy's building sandcastles. I thought that was Ava's job. It's a bit broken. Oh! <laughs> Lose glasses on. Yeah. Oh, what? Why are you taking them for? Mm -hmm. I don't want them. Trump. What are you building? What's that? Why won't it open? Don't know. Look, there's an artwork on the top. What if you come to the front? It might be a bit wet now. Ava, I think it's going to look right against the seat. Yeah, it's just going to get soaked. Oh, someone's eating them, seagull or something. It's not a bone! It's not an animal! That is a bone, it's not! That is what the fuck is that? That is an animal, I'm telling you, that is a sheep or something. Oh, that's like skin of his body, that's his insides. I told you! Oh! Oh, you're fucking swimming in that! Oh, that's a body! Oh! You? That's got, that's his claws, yeah, look. Oh, oh my, that is fucking vile, man. Oh, that's his bum hole, look. <laughs> what the fuck that's is that? That's like a rabbit. No, what is that? Look, look, it's bone sticking out of it. Oh, that's touching my skin. <laughs> Get one of you. Oh, that is fucking disgusting. I that is whole, how the fuck did that get in here? No one's being stupid, and that's not an animal, it's a plastic bag. Oh. Like, how does that get in the sea? It's like a sheep or something. That is massive. You don't come to the sea and expect to see a, a sheep or something in the water. Oh. But it is very beautiful here. This is a lovely place. Look at that. What bird? What bird is that big? It's got claws on the fucking back of it and a bum hole. What's a bird? What That's bird? Just massive. That looks like a seal or something. Seal? Oh, yeah, it's a seal. Good thinking. Seal? Seal, yeah, yeah a little seal, yeah, look. Hands. That's his back, the claws. Yeah, look. Yeah, it's a seal. What's that bird? You found a seal. Okay, I can understand the seal being there, not a sheep. I thought it was a sheep. Yeah, I thought it was a sheep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's so sad. Oh, they're animal seals. Leo's, Leo's bouncing. <laughs> yeah, they might be uh, come from any of these ships. One hour later. Tide's coming in quite quick now. Look at this little island here. We've been here. It's like an island, isn't it? The water's all the way around us. Look at that man, look at that. There he goes. Life's a beach, eh?
blades back. Gone in a second. I know. I could swap that. <laughs> so we're now stuck on this. Did you just do that? No. Who was that? We were playing football in there. <laughs> we are stuck. Fuck. Oh, let's go, Leo. Fuck me. Look how deep that is. Fuck. Oh my god. Fuck me. That is deep, man. <laughs> you nearly got stuck. <laughs> nearly got stuck in this. That's happened to me once in Cornwall or Penzance. St Michael's Mount. We got stuck and the tides came round. Look at that little hole. That's where we were playing. <laughs> we were so lucky. We were there like three minutes. 12 seconds later. <laughs> Later. So it's food time. It's got to be done. You're at the beach. Five fish and chips. Yeah, boy. One eternity later. So guys, there we have it. The end of two amazing weeks. Had an awesome weekend with the family. Great going to see my nan yesterday. Um, dementia is a difficult thing. Lots of different emotions throughout the visit. Uh, but you know, you got to stick with your family. So, you know, much love, man. Well, anyway, guys, there we go. We've had an interesting two weeks, like I said. Hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you like this video. And if you've watched every minute up until this very point, I would like you to comment below. Seaside. You know it. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you for watching. And I'll see you in two weeks.